recorded for um, anybody who's, who's wondering that. So, when you walked in tonight, if you've been in here, you probably realize that I look like I've gained a little bit of weight. <laughs> I'm very sensitive about it, so please don't laugh. Um, <laughs> that's a total joke. If I can get, <laughs> ma'am. Yes. If I can get you to just sign in on the roster, and then fill out one of the hold harmless agreements. Oh, okay. that would be fantastic. Okay. Um, so you're fat. <laughs> yes. <laughs> so I'm, fat. I'm fat and I'm happy about it. Um, <laughs> I mean, you're being nice. <laughs> Actually, what we're doing tonight is uh, what I have done is I have concealed either one or more guns on me. <clears throat> Does anybody want to take a guess at how many? Okay, so we're kind of all over the gamut. Um, <laughs> what I'm going to do is, I'm going to be, I'm going to end up removing this layer of clothing, but only one because you didn't pay enough for me to remove two. <laughs> <laughs> terribly difficult for women to conceal and a lot of times we think that we have to buy an entire new wardrobe or we have to buy a special purse um, and a lot of times we don't want to carry on our body because that's just gonna be a little bit too difficult um, I would kind of like to prove to you that that's not today um, what we're gonna start off with is this one that I've got just right here at my abdomen this right here is my Springfield XDM Compact, that's a 45. And this is this is actually my, my primary everyday primary carry gun. And what I've got is that where you carry it every day? That's one of my primary carry ones. And, and you carry it there. That's for heavy days. She's gonna lose She's gonna lose We'll get to oh, that. <laughs> this is just in a simple paddle. Holster. It's made out of Kydex, which is molded, um, and this is actually the one that came with it, which is surprising because most of those are just kind of junky. Um, this actually works out really well for me, though. Fits well on the belt and works out well. So that's something like that is one option that you got to get. Now, some people like to have what they call a cross draw. They like to kind of reach over and then get one out. So you can do that. Right here, I have one in a retention holster, which actually snaps. So you can wear this on either side. So just draw that out. I've got my trainer with me today um, because my husband went off for a weekend with the boys and took some guns, so I had to improvise. <laughs> <laughs> this one's not going to hurt you, though. <laughs> and if you want to see this one, it is just a difficult to get off a little bit. Now, do you got a belt on or is it just going? Through? I do have a belt on okay. and I'm going to go over that in a, in a moment too um, and tell the story about once again how I prove I'm smarter than my husband. Um, <laughs> this just has a belt clip on it. This actually has a pouch up here for an extra magazine. So that is great to, to carry. Um, that's a little bit big and something, this is actually meant to hold a full size. What it typically carries is a uh, Taurus PT92, which is the copy of the Beretta 92 FS. So, would that be a 9 millimeter? That is a 9 millimeter. Absolutely. It's a very good 9 millimeter. All right, so moving on along, that's two, two, two so far. Okay. Two the <laughs> You're getting thinner. I'm getting thinner. This is the best weight loss program ever. Okay. So what we're going to move on to next is what I've got in what's called a belly band. This is just a band 
that fits across kind of wherever you want it to go. Um, you can put it down kind of low on your hips. You can put it right at your rib cage, right under your breast, kind of however you want it to go. And it's got a bunch of different little pockets in it. I've actually got one right here. kind of show you how it's made. This is really strong Velcro. It's great stuff. It stretches out so you can, you just kind of have to measure your waist. We've got these available on the Well Armed Woman website, um, as are most of these. And you've got pockets. You can kind of put it in whatever position that you want to. You know, it'll go around wherever you want to fasten it. Um, you've got little places where you can put extra magazines. If you're out, if you're a runner, and you're out walking in the neighborhood, a lot of folks use this particular sort of belly band just for that purpose. You can put your ID in there with you, you know, a couple of couple of dollar bills. I've got one. I throw my cell phone and you, everything in when I leave. Everything in it. In so you've yeah. actually got. I got it off the site and it's fantastic. You you like it? I love it. Fantastic. I wear it every day when I'm. How big walk. of a gun can go in there? You can fit a full size one in there. And you can, you can be a left-handed or a right-handed. Why'd you person. ask? <laughs> <laughs> if you want to do another cross draw, we've got what I've got here. What I've got right here is actually a Peril Ordinance 1911. Now this is this is a full size, so that's gonna that is a that's a rather large or the large gun, and I feel so much lighter. <laughs> But the great thing about the belly band is if you kind of want to do a double cross draw and you're left handed too, uh, <laughs> you can also pull this one out. <laughs> now this is actually the aforementioned Taurus PT-92 in 9mm. The only thing that I would caution you about regarding the belly band or any of those that kind of fit close to your skin is Make sure that they're going to wick moisture away because if you're going to wear it all day, you can collect condensation on your gun. And rust is a gun's first enemy and best friend. Oh. It's attracted to it like a magnet, it loves it. So I would just say just be, be mindful of that because it, it, can, it can impart some, um, some condensation on there and cause you some, cause you some trouble. So, how do you prevent? Is there something underneath it? Is there supposed to put? Is there something on your body and put that over that? I would. I, how how do you do? You wear a Lay shirt under, under it? No, I don't. No. I only have it on for about an hour in the morning mm -hmm. when I walk because I leave very early just after the sun comes up, mm -hmm. and so I don't. So I have not had a problem having it on for an hour while okay. I walk. Never. Okay. I haven't really had it on longer than that. Okay. So I haven't had any issues with that at all. Don't know about that. Yeah. yeah. So have, and it's very really good. No, I just carry a Ruger LCR. It's a little 38 revolver, lightweight, just for walking because it's real lightweight and easy to conceal and carry. So, yeah. And it, the the belly band is not one. I've got one. This one is mine, but I don't wear it often. I just don't really typically have much of an occasion to wear it. But it's it's there if I need it. And I know that others work out with it religiously. They go when they go walking, go walking in the neighborhood and whatnot. And they they love it. Um, I would think, especially if you've got a polymer gun, you're going to have much less of a of an issue. Also, on yeah. too. Plus, it can probably hold in your belly. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. That's a turtle. Dual purpose. <laughs> Dual purpose. <laughs> Don't we love those? <laughs> okay, so that's four so far. And I'm going to have these holsters over here for you guys to, to look at and kind of touch.